Hello everybody, I'm Palkefan08 and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. Well, who's talking to us here? Well, who could it be, I mean? Who do we know who lives in here? Anyway, who was it? Who would disturb my slumber? Wh who's there? Class Fink. Yeah, if I didn't mention this, this in the last episode, uh, those two buttons open the hole in the floor. Okay, I'm just gonna warn you, when I press the button one more time now, you might actually get your mind a little bit blown by some awesome, awesome music. Okay, are you ready for this? Okay, here we go. So it was you! Yeah! This song, Fighting the Spirit, is by far my favorite song in this game. It's... oh my god. It's probably my favorite song in the entire series. It's just that good. Anyway, Undini, she can actually be pretty damn challenging. So what I... Do not let her cast, for the love of pickles. She will hurt you. Oh crap. Well, I suck. <laughs> Ow. Glarth, please. No, no, no. Archie, please do something. Okay, thank you, Clark. But don't think that she is a... Yeah, she can heal too. Right. Don't think that she is a pure spellcaster. Oh no! She can hurt you bad with that sword of hers. Oh yes. Thank you, RJ. Now, do the same. On... Yeah, the slugs. Thank you. Just continue wailing on her. This battle is a lot like the uh, Demeter battle. Since uh, you're you're trapped and there's uh, yeah, there's enemies on both sides and you got a very powerful spellcaster against you. And uh, yeah, she can hurt you bad. If you let her. Archie, please, finish off the squid. Come on. Thank you, Clarth. Okay, uh, Mint. Why are you just... Please, help us here. Acid rain. Thank you. Acid rain. Ow, ow. See, she can hurt pretty bad. And why is Arche actually physically attacking? She should not be doing that. I'm a little bit underleveled this battle too, so... Uh, that's why I'm kinda having a little bit problems with her. That and she is actually very challenging. Thank you. Yeah, that works. But seriously, this music, oh god. It's, oh. Is it, she, she's a survivor, wow. Just continue wailing on her and you should be okay. Ow. Mint, please, please do something. Oh, yay! <laughs> okay, Undine is down. Good, good. Wow, I would never think, thought that a squid would be the last thing to die. Oh well. <laughs> and we are done, ladies and gentlemen. Awesome. Level ups. Sweet.
Uh, well, that was fun. F forgive me. What is it you desire? I wish to form a, a summoning pact with you. You have already proven your worth. Yeah, damn straight I have. We shall form the pact upon the aquamarine ring. No way, really? The aquamarine? You? I would never have guessed. I thought you were more of a garnet type of person. Spirit of water, I desire a pact and ask you now. Submit to me! Upon this ring we form our pact, spirit and master. My name is Clarth. Yahoo! And now Clarth can summon Undini. Kinda spoil it for spoiled it for about two seconds there, but I don't care. He can now summon Undini. Awesome. Now we don't have to listen to Sylf! Zilf! Sylf all the time. So yeah, that's pretty much it in here. So now we have to go after the next spirit. Which I will I choose to go after Gnome next. Remember I told you the boat in Albanista is the easiest way to get to Gnome? Well, I'm gonna meet you right there. It's very easy to get out of here, come on. I don't need to show you that, do I? Nah, of course not. Anyway, I will meet you all at the Albanista dock. Okay, we are back at uh, Albanista Harbor. So, let's just talk to this guy. This cargo ship bound for Belladam. We can only take you one way. Let's see. Blah blah blah, yeah, the same thing. Okay, that's cheap. Let's go. The reason I'm not going after Ifrit now is because both Undini and Gnome are pretty much um, backtracking. And Ifrit, you can, f yeah, yeah, you have to go that way anyway. So, um, I like to save Ifrit for last. Anyway, remember this place? If you didn't get the fight symbol, go do it now. Anyway, let's see if we can find this cave of spirits, shall we? Oh no, it's not here. Damn. <laughs> I'm kind of not completely sure where it is. So forgive me if I'm making a fool of myself. And it's right there, where I just was. Well, I'm feeling pretty stupid right now then. <laughs> Idiot. Anyway, this should be it. Welcome to the Cave of Spirits, where we heard that the spirit of Earth, Gnome, was living. So, let's just go through here. Okay, let's go. Really, there's nothing special about this place. Um, enemies are weak, and it's a short dungeon, so... But it got a door with an eye on it! Ah! If you want, if you wish to break the seal, speak the password. Uh, the password? Do we got the password? Yes, we do. Remember the password that we paid thousand gold to Sakuraba to get? Yeah, that password. Pa s word. Yeah, that's it. Fus ro da. Pretty much. <laughs> oh, I'll be playing way too much Skyrim. Okay, anyway though. Hmm, what's that? Hi. Hey, I'm a lost boy. How about taking me to where everyone else is? Everyone is. Will you take him with you? Yeah, we pretty much have to, so... Hooray! So, he will now follow you. Do not go too far away from him, or else he'll just say, screw it, and go back to where you found him. So, yeah, it's a little bit annoying, but... And he's not really the fastest little guy either, so... Oh, there's more of them. But they will fight us. Why? Okay, clay idols. Remember I told you that you really, really should buy a tractor beam? Well, let's see. Uh, let's use the spectacles on them. You see, they got 1 HP. But they cannot be harmed by anything. Except the tractor beam spell. So let's use it. Hopefully he will... Ah, oh, crap. Oh, well. Okay, we got three of them, that's good. Yes, the only thing that can kill them are that they fall on their heads. That's pretty cool, actually. <laughs> A little bit stupid, but pretty cool. And down he goes. 
And they give crap for experience and gold. Yay. Awesome. Not. Anyway, let's go in here. Okay, on my on my test run of this game, I found something very interesting in this little room, but I cannot for the life of me remember where it, where it was. I think it was in here at least. I found one of those hidden treasures. And it was a question mark sword. If it was in here or here, I can't remember, but yeah, the question mark sword. And it was a slayer sword. A sword that you are not supposed to have until much later in the game. But it didn't really see that I can find it now, so too bad. But I'm not really that sad about it. I mean, as I said, the sword is very strong and I don't want to break the game that much. Anyway, more clay idols. Sweet. Wait, what am I saying? These are, these are just stupid filler battles. Come on, hit them all. Come on. Nope. Oh, come on. He's inside it. Blah, stupid. Oh, well. Fly and fall flat on your face. Bye. <laughs> Yatta. Oh, well, we get mixed gummies from them, so that's cool. Very nice indeed, though. Anyway, come on. We are almost there. Okay, I'm cutting this battle. It's the same as before. Of course, the one battle that I cut, I actually hit all four of them. Well, come on. There we go. Good boy. Was it in here? I, I cannot remember. Oh, well, whatever. Hey, there's the rest of the gang. Oh, there they are. Now he speeds up, of course. And they just run off. Not even a thank you. How sweet. Blah, stupid. I don't really care. Anyway, you can go over there, but it's really nothing interesting there. So, uh, let's just go in here. You will end up in here anyway, so. Hi. What? You wanna fight? Well, do you? No, I will not. Boring. As you can see, they are guarding a door. It's no point fighting them. They will just respawn. So, um, there's two more over here, but that that's just a empty room, so that's pointless too. Go over here instead, and push this switch. Yes, I will... F okay, flip it, whatever. Oh my god, what an annoying sound. But apparently, they find it interesting. Huh? What's up with the alarm? And it's just gonna stand there. Okay, so now the door is open. A very big empty room. Suspicious. What is this place? Yeah, gee, I wonder what it can be. Well, find out next time on Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. I'm Palka 508 I thank you all for watching, and I see you all later.